Hey, I'm just gonna head out for a little bit. What are you two doing? <laughs> wow! But what happened? You have ants in your pants? You're not going out like that, are you? Like what? Your cat ears, they're so bright and so clashy. What happened to your other ones? Someone took them! These are the only ones I have. Yeah, it's Halloween! They're not Halloween-y. They're uh, regular. Yeah, well, you shouldn't wear those. I think we should find your other ones. No, I'm going out like this. Huh, of course. Classic little sister behavior. You never listen to me. Is there someone else that I can ask? You. Uh, me? Yeah, you. What do you think about her orange, super bright, clashy cat ears? Um, they, they are a little clashy. The only person I will listen to is my other big sister. Oh, well then. I feel so underappreciated. I'm your big sister and I'm saying those are clashy and you don't want to listen to me. No, I mean I need another big sister that can help me paint my cat ears to match me. <sighs> well, I can do that. Yeah, no, you're not the best at painting. I am too. Yeah, last time you painted all over my room and mommy got mad. That was one minor incident. Okay, fine. Cupcake, you have to make us a bigger sister so that she could paint her cat ears. Well then, if that's the only reason, then I don't really see... Now, okay then. Please? I guess we're forced into making another OMG makeover for the little LOLs. We're not little. Yeah, I'm a big baby. I'm little. Well, at least someone's not in denial. What's denial? It's a river in Egypt. Who's going to help us with this makeover? <laughs> Who's filling in? It's this doll right here. I forgot her name. It's the Marilyn Monroe uh, wannabe. I am not a Marilyn Monroe wannabe. I simply adore her. And I'm just cosplaying as her. You guys, she's in need of a makeover. I'm sorry. It just, it just, it was, she was so clashy. I mean, I think this was one of the OMG dolls that I've been itching to make over. And finally, we have someone to make her into. Let's call it a better cause. Big sister for a little LOL. And we get to give her a much cuter outfit. That's not so clashy. Hey, I am highly offended. No, I'm not. I'm just kidding. I really need a makeover. Well, first step up is giving her a haircut. I'm going to first remove her head so that we don't mess up all of her clothes with the tidbits of hair that fly everywhere. And we're going to do that with some hot water. Five minutes will do. So here we go. Let's get some hot water in here. Oh, yeah. Whenever you're crafting, remember, caution. For my younger audience, be sure to get the help of a parent. Get her head in for about five minutes. This will soften the plastics and it'll soften the glue of the hair that's on the inside. That's gonna make it a whole lot easier to scrape out of her head. Wee! Okay, it's time to get her out. I think I left her in there a little longer than I intended, but let's see. Let's see how the head is going. Oh, it's not going good. Mm -mm. She's been in there for so long that I think the water went cold again. Oh, there you go. There you go. We got it. It's okay. Everything's okay. Now it's time to remove her pretty jewelry. And time to give her a hair guard. Let's get the extra water out of her hair. Probably not the cleanest way to do it, but we don't do clean here. I probably have one of the most chaotic doll makeovers that you will ever see. All right, here we go. Here goes her yellow neon highlighter hair. Say bye-bye. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at her bangs. Come to think of it, she has a lot of hair. She reminds me of that, uh, is it Weird Barbie? Yeah, she reminds me of her. I pre-ordered her, by the way. Overly played with Barbie. All we need is this and a little bit of this. Yeah, I think the, uh, we're good for the makeover. Yeah, that's good. So glad you guys can join me. Just kidding. Now let's remove the rest of her hair with a screwdriver. All right, here's her head all cleaned up. Let's get everything inside of her head out. Ew, buggers! So that's that. We've got everything out of her head. And now it's time to buff her head up. 
So here we go. Let's get the paint of her little head. And yes, at this point, I could pretty much remove her face paint, but I don't want to scare you guys with a bald face staring at you the whole time. Let's just keep her face there for now. Now, taking a nail buffer, I'm just gonna buff her head up a little bit more. Now let's grab some paint. I think I'm gonna start off with this sweet mint, or since we're leaning more towards a light bluish greenish, maybe this one would be a better choice. This is a drift. Let's just get some on. Oh, okay. Let's see, for the purple part, we're doing Espeon. This is such a pretty lavender and it's so bright. It's exactly what we need for our OMG Troublemaker. So let's do a little bit of that to do the strip on the front and then the rest is going to be whimsy. That's also from the Doll Planet here. Oh, here's the color, it's so pretty. Here we go, she's getting her first little hair. There you go. She looks so cute. All right, let's do the rest. Super speed. Well, look at that. We're already at the stage where we make her an outfit. So I've got our fabric pieces cut up already. These are going to be her shorts. So let's get right to it. Wouldn't let you go if you left me Wouldn't let you go if we're standing miles apart I'd be a domino I would let you know Through vibrations of me Wouldn't let you go if you left me Wouldn't let you go if we're standing miles apart I'd be a domino You would feel my flow On the ground beneath you
me some, give me some energy Wanna come, wanna come, wanna come, wanna come, wanna come dance with me Give me some, give me some, give me some, give me some, give me some energy Wanna come, wanna come, wanna come, wanna come, wanna come dance with me There's no fire when I smoke, I ain't letting you go I can see you buzzing like you can't say no There's no fire left for placement. Now see, that wasn't so bad, was it? <sighs> Whatever. I'm still winning. Anyways, he'll be back. guys after several failed attempts of trying to get these little spikes on to these ears I realized these are too thin to get anything on so I'm just gonna add a little bit more warbler to the sides here towards the back you won't be able to see it in the front but that'll give me enough space to get those spikes on Now 
that we've got the glue in there, it's time to let her head sit for about two hours. But in the meantime, let's do her shoes. I found these cute shoes. I don't remember which OMG doll it belongs to because I kind of take all the accessories and shoes off the dolls and put them in organizers. Alright, it's now time to boil wash her hair. So let's go ahead and do that and I will be right back. And we're back. She's all boil washed. We just need to fix the hair situation here a little bit. So I'm going to brush her hair out and then give her a haircut. And now I boil washed her hair three more times and here's what we've got. I think it's pretty good. Let's start doing my favorite part, and that's the face up. All right, let's quickly give her a little hairdo. to focus and fix my kitty ears because it's all about me. Well, I tell. Mm-hmm. This is where the focus needs to be. Uh, don't listen to Hobbit's sister. You don't have to. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, good luck dealing with this one. I gladly hand over my big sister duties over to you. Listen here, you little person. The only thing I make is trouble. I don't make kitty ears. I didn't ask you to make them. I asked you to fix them. This is too much responsibility. Whose fault is this? Well, would you look at the time? What a wonderful family. Good luck with that. Hey, what do you mean? I hope you guys enjoyed making OMG Troublemaker with me. Remember, her coloring page is available on the Cupcake Kids Club or Cupcake Squad Club <laughs> Facebook page. I will leave all the information in the description box below so that either you or for my younger audience, your parents, can go and print it out for you and color it if you want. I had lots of fun making OMG Troublemaker. It was a challenge, that is for sure. But all OMG makeovers are are a challenge. I always go into them very nervous because I'm not sure if I can make exactly what I drew. But I think she turned out pretty okay. Click the thumbs up button if you want more OMG makeovers. Subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye for now.